Hello. Right, so today I want to talk about something that uh, something that makes people. I think I think I can't categorize obviously, but it makes people think who have depression that they may be fraudulent, and that is the fact that you can't see it, um, and you can just carry on everyday life. To a certain extent, doing the things that you always do, but that inner turmoil can't be seen. For me, those voices in my head and those hallucinations can't be seen by anyone but me. Um, the hallucinations that I get inside, uh, in my head. Um, and people, the doctors ask you, is that, are they coming from inside your head or does it feel like it's coming from outside? Oh, I get both. And they're usually very derogatory as well, you know, kind of name calling and, um, you know, saying other things to you that uh, it kind of feels like it's, they're trying to tip you over the edge, you know. But I feel sometimes that when I go out and about, you know, I kind of I look okay. I mean, I mean, and, and I'm not, I'm not okay at all. Um, I'm feeling pretty low at the moment, uh, the lowest I have been today um, uh, for a wee while. Um, although in saying that, I still do think the sertraline I'm taking is doing its job. Uh, I've got to give it time anyway, I've got to give it a few weeks to, to really kick in. Um, but you know, it can be quite a, the, the whole invisible illness um, thing where you know, somebody breaks a leg and you can visibly see that the leg is broken, you know, but with uh, with depression, bipolar disorder, many other disorders, um, you can't see um, unless that person displays their, displays their behaviour or, dis, you know, displays symptoms in front of you. Um, Certainly, there's still, you know, there's people that I've met that were surprised to have bipolar disorder. I think it, it's it been portrayed in films and TV programmes not quite correctly. Um, and they're portrayed as uh, mad men or mad women, you know, but that's really not the case. And they spend more time in depression usually than mania. And mania doesn't usually last awfully long. Um, but... You know my inner turmoil. It's there, and uh, at times it's it's painful. It just feels uh, like you're in pain. You know, and uh, I would just sometimes I think I would just give anything just to be rid of it, or hope that they find a cure for this sort of thing. You know, the the medication just suppresses everything. It doesn't take it away. It's still there. Um. Well, it's supposed to suppress, suppress the condition. Uh, sometimes it, that doesn't work. Um, but, yeah, so that was it today. It's just about, you know, um, the invisible illness thing um, that people talk about. Um, it can be really debilitating. And while somebody seems, while you might believe that somebody seems okay on the outside, um, you know, they're really not on the inside. Um, so anyway, uh, until the next time, see you all later.